I just wanted to do a quick tutorial on how to press flowers onto glass so that you can display them and enjoy them. Uh, so I just got this beautiful rustic window off of Craigslist and this was kind of my vision collecting these flowers. I collected them uh, throughout my travels in Europe and just was pressing them in a notebook as I went. So they've been in that notebook for about four months now, just sitting there. And I finally decided to get this project going. So it's really simple. Um, all you need to do is just get whatever surface you're working on. It could just be glass, it could be a photo frame, uh, it could be a window like this, whatever you have or whatever you want to use. And then basically you're going to Windex the back side of it, which is where you're going to be pressing the flowers. So when I'm done with this and this is all uh, glued on, it's going to be the other side, it's going to be the front that's going to be displayed. So you just arrange your flowers after you Windex and uh, got the surface all clean. So I have them all arranged here. And it's really simple. All you need is some Mod Podge. And I got the gloss finish. So I just have um, a small one of that. And then you're just going to need a paintbrush. And then you want to not do it too thick. You can actually do two coats on this. So I've already started working, as you can see. They're drying. And what it's going to do is it's going to look like glue when you first put it on but it's gonna dry clear. So when you first put it on, it's really white. And like I said, you don't want it too thick, but you want it thick enough so that all of the uh, surface is covered. And if there's any gaps, the Mod Podge is in between the glass and the flower. So you just brush that on. And then you just go to the next piece. There we go, like that. Even that's a little bit too thick, I'd say. You could do a little bit less than that, kind of brush it. There you go. Okay, and I'm just gonna keep working on this. the finished piece it's so beautiful I'm so happy with how it turned out um, yeah so you could hang it on a wall I was thinking maybe even drilling holes through it and then you could hang it um, from the ceiling or just put it in front of a window so that the light goes through it you can get creative with it do whatever you want but yep this is it and then as you could see the glue dried uh, clear I actually did a little bit too much so like I said earlier in my video, um, just when you're putting it, just kind of wipe it off so it's a thinner layer, but I don't know. I've showed people and they said that they really like this look and then it, it could even be pretty if it's completely covered with this so that you can't really see through the window and it kind of gives it that texture. So it's kind of up to you what kind of style you like, but there it is. Mm -hmm.